What's going on YouTube? GSNO right here. Today with great news for those of you waiting for a jailbreak on iOS 15. A jailbreak has been announced. It's basically Electra 5.0 coming from Coolstar. This video is brought to you by Anytrans, a software that allows you to drag and drop files directly from your computer to your device. Manage everything on your device with ease. Check it out in the link below. Also, thank you to all of you who are supporting this channel on Patreon. The patrons are now on your screen. So, do you guys remember Electra? It was an iOS 11 jailbreak made by Coolstar and their team, it's this one in here, well, wasn't exactly very good at the time, it was a little bit buggy, but still, it did serve a purpose. It was, I think, one of the first jailbreaks for iOS 11, if not really the first. So this, of course, is about to take a comeback. Yes, the next jailbreak from Coolstar is not going to be Taurin or Chimera or anything like that, it's going to be apparently Electra 5.0. Coolstar posted today, quote, can't wait to drop Electra 5.0 soon. Now, where is this all coming from? Well, it seems from this. Binary Boy posted a couple of days ago a kernel exploit, which is now open source and available for iOS 15.1.1, 15.2 beta 1 and lower. And of course, this can be used for jailbreak purposes, and as such, it will be used by Coolstar. There is an important distinction, though. This jailbreak is very likely going to be rootless, which means it's not going to remount the root FS. No, they did not figure out how to do that, how to bypass the new sealed root file system at this point, so they are going to go with a rootless approach, which requires the tweaks to be updated, but still you will be able to jailbreak and install tweaks. Now, since this is going to be Electra, expect it to have Cilio instead of, you know, Cydia and stuff like that. Cilio being this one here, a product of Coolstar and their team. Brand new package manager that looks great, it has the new UI design that basically matches the new iOS 15 and 14 and stuff compared to Syria, which is indeed pretty outdated looking. Now, I know many of you are indeed in love with Syria. It's probably your first package manager, so I do understand why you don't like Cilio, but this is very likely what this jailbreak will come with. I guess we're going to see if Syria will be ported to work with Electra 5.0, but for now it's probably going to be Cilio that it comes with. So yeah, that's basically it. Electra is making a comeback. Definitely wait for that. It seems that at this point it may not take that much more. So what versions will be supported then? Well, 15.0, 15.0.1, 15.0.2, 15.1, 15.1.1, .1, and 15.2 beta 1. Not 15.2 in here, not 15.2 beta 2, unfortunately. Just 15.2 beta 1. You're going to tell me, well, I stayed on beta 2, what can I do? Not much you can do at this point. We couldn't know at that time that beta 1 will be supported and beta 2 wouldn't, because by the time they were no longer signed, Binary Boy released their exploit, but not before, so we couldn't tell in advance. Anyways, for those of you who are on the right version, expect Electra jailbreak to be updated to version 5.0, which will support iOS 15 up to the versions that I mentioned. Thank you for watching, we'll keep you updated with anything that's going on in the jailbreak community. Support this channel on Patreon if you can and if you want, and I definitely appreciate that, and peace out.